Well, if you didn't look at the calendar, you might be surprised that today was the first day of fall. It certainly didn't feel like it. Reporter Shannon Slatton explains how fall came in with a heat advisory in tow. Well, the leaves have come to turn in. When the calendar rolls over to fall, we know it by the leaves changing colors on the trees and the pumpkins ripening in the fields. But while it may look like fall, it certainly doesn't feel that way today. Summer in the city, back of my neck, getting dirty and gritty. Stinks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready for campfires and sweatshirts. Walkers in Robbinsdale got out early, wearing tank tops and toting water bottles. Getting our exercise in because I think we're just going to do some inside stuff today before it gets really, really hot out. Hoping we get some cool off before the really hot stuff gets here. It's a different attitude though in Maple Grove. Last blast of summer. The fountains here at Central Park is one of the few water parks still open after Labor Day. It's supposed to be 90 degrees, so instead of being stuck at home, we thought we should head on out and let the kids get all their energy out. This could perhaps be the last hot day to enjoy being outside in the water. It was a hot day, really hot, and we thought we would have fun here. That's the great thing about Minnesota. Hennepin County meteorologist Sarah Carroll knows that all too well. It's the first day of fall, <laughs> but we are definitely feeling more like summer today. While it's not unusual to hit the 90s in September, it usually happens when people are thinking about eating fried things on a stick. It's a little abnormal. Um, to start seeing that now all of a sudden pop up, especially since it's not state fair anymore. But Carol says today's weather will not be record setting. Pretty rare for September for us to have a heat index that high. Um, we do typically hit 90 um, every few years in September, but it's definitely not an every year occurrence. The drink choices always change on the weather. Coffee shops like the Daily Dose in Maple Grove can often predict their menu by the weather. Today, it's less about the lattes. We always do have a lot of waters ready to go. I'm the king of selling free waters. And more about getting something cool. Uh, today is an exceptional day. Enjoy it while you can, because before you know it, it will be... In Maple Grove, Shannon Slatton, CCX News. Oh boy, <laughs> just in case we do get a few more warm days, the splash pad at Central Park in Maple Grove should be open until the end of the month.